Hello and welcome back to my Victoria 2 Ultimate Mod Napoleonic Friends Let's Play. Last episode, as you can see, we continued the war and successfully won against Austria and Hungary has been born. We have effectively split the nation in two. Uh, there was just these two random provinces just left here. Um, but Austria is looking pretty down ugly. Uh, they are still a great power. They've just dropped a place. The Ottomans have overtaken them. Uh, I keep fluctuating between, like, Prussia, Britain, and Russia. Uh, I think the highest I've ever got was second place. I can't quite remember. I know during the war I was, like, second place. Uh, but then I dropped down to fourth and I've overtaken Russia again. I don't know why. I don't know how Russia's got up there. I've got so much... Sorry, Prussia. I think it's their prestige. But, yeah. Uh, we're organising our armies as well. And we're making plans for other invasions. And I think I have decided what I might try and do. I might try and take out Madagascar. If I could get an uh, an army to Bourbon, then it would be a good invasion. But the trouble is, you know what's going to happen. And that is uh, a lot of attrition and, like, death. <laughs> so, it would be a very sort of risky thing. I could possibly lose a whole army because of it. I've actually had a look at over here in quite some time. Uh, still expanding forts and stuff. Must have missed that. I can colonise that. So we will do. What the fuck's this? Oh shit, Colombia. How did that happen? Seriously, how the fuck did Colombia get born? I don't know. Colombia. That's strange. I've never seen that. Uh, what is our relationship like with America? Pretty good, isn't it? Uh, I do give them military access. I could actually declare war and liberate slaves, but I'm not going to. Um, I want to give them this land, but there's no option, is there? Let's have a look at our decision. We can build a sewer, build Panama. What's this? Uh, in 1867, at the behest of the Japanese shogunate and at Edu, France, sent a military mission to Japan to help train shogunate troops in the arts of Western warfare. The mission was led by then Captain Charles Chanoin, who would later go on to become France's Minister of War during the Prussian Br Br government of 1898. Send a, send a military Send a military mission to Japan and our relations with them are sure to improve. When do we get this? Ah, we've got to just get a load of relations and stuff. Build the, the Palais Garnia. It was from its inauguration in 1875 to 1889. Uh, 1989. Uh, the chief, um, blah, 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 what does it even do? Tempest Siege, I don't even know. And that's it. There's no, like, sort of give America provinces, but oh well. I mean, they should have cores, should they not? No, they don't. They don't even have cores there. New England has cores here. And who's that? Manhattan Commune. Alabama. Okay. Um. So. Oh, I forgot the Danish had bloody territory in Africa. Uh, what about some uh, some like sort of Middle Eastern campaigns? How do you reckon that'd go? If we annex like Abu Dhabi or somewhere. Uh, I mean, it'd be a lot easier if we got the Suez Canal built. I'm gonna try it. I don't know what army to send. However, you. I'm on your way. You can go up there. Dusseldorf. Dusseldorf. And I think I'll just send the first army. Send the first army. Do you think they could manage it? I mean, I could always do lots of stops. Do you know what I mean? Like, I could just stop off at colonies on the way. And that might just prevent so many losses. Like, we could stop off straight away at Saurura. And then down at Freetown. 
and down at South Africa. Although these colonies, these African provinces, probably have attrition on them anyway, so. We'll have a look. We'll see how many men we lose. We've got 56 brigades, or divisions. No brigades. Uh, and you've got 33,000 men. We'll see how many See how many you lose. You have 5% attrition already. You got zero attrition there. Right, so some of these ne these provinces won't actually have any attrition, which is quite nice. Did not expect that. Uh, and we're getting two more, well, one more dragoon, should I say? And then I think our army is sort of been replenished in a way. Uh, they're only actually pretty sure it was Muggles again. I'm going to fund the Muggles. Not that they'll actually get any money, apparently. Uh, so, let's plan. <coughs> let's take Yemen. In fact, no, let's take Abu Dhabi. Although they are allied with more nations, so let's just take Yemen out. We'll establish a protectorate. So why not? It's cheaper. Uh, it's quicker, should I say. Well, I'll see how quick that was. Not that time's really of the essence on this mod since I have like deleted everything. Okay, we'll move you around to Freetown now. Keep an eye on you though. Five percent attrition, yeah. I think five percent attrition must be like the standard for travelling across the sea. Uh zero percent attrition. Good. This is good. This is very good. Uh we can increase our opinion in Cologne. Apparently. Uh, Hesse Darmstadt. Trouble is with this, I fucking hate all of these. Finding all these bloody little gem provinces and nations. Bit annoying. Nassau. That's you, isn't it? Uh, one thing that I do actually need to think about doing is... Building factories in foreign nations because this allows you to build up influence. If we have a look at our sphere of influence, we've only really got our earned provinces and Hungary. We don't even have Italy now, hardly. You know, we're not really that wide reaching, are we? We've only got our own provinces and, and Hungary. So I need to fa start thinking about expanding my uh, sphere of influence. One of the best ways you can do that is, is basically by building factories in other provinces, in other nations, shall I say. Uh, well, North America, there's only Colombia. We might as well, which we can't do. What about America? Can we build any in America? Yes, we can. So it's just like, <clears throat> Even the uh, this isn't going to help them because we don't have enough workers. It's just expanding factories and just pumping money into their economy, and it makes them more friendly to us and more better towards us. I did not mean to do that. Uh, South America, there's only Venezuela, but we will put some money there anyway. Uh, Africa, no nation. So shit ton in in. In Europe, uh, nothing there, nothing there. Can't, can't open factories. I will expand that. Braunschweig, Bremen, Denmark, Cologne. That factory needs expanding anyway. Uh, Frankfurt, all these like one province or c a couple of province nations, they, they tend to not have uh, any factories really, so. I will build, build some in Hungary just so it secures my. Like these are all the factories that Austria's lost, so, lost. so it's a pretty good war that I'd say. Italy, um, Hanover. Holstein, Krakow, no, 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 Mecklenburg, Nassau, yes, 
Oldenburg. Nope. Netherlands. Yes, but you got a lot of closed factories. Portugal. <coughs> no. Württemberg. Oh, you are. You've got. You need your factories expanding. Saxony. Indeed, and that'll do. Uh, there is Asian. No, there isn't Asian. There's nothing. If so we go back to all, and then we'll do it by that. So we've invested the most in America, Hungary, and Saxony, which is fine. Uh, okay, let's get back to sending our troops over to. Where am I going to send them to? Have we got military access in the Ottomans? I do now, so I can send them over there and then I can just invade. Uh, right, let's go. You're gonna go to Grand Bassam. I know it's not very far away, but <coughs> I just want to do it anyway. And then we'll let our men recover, which is the idea. <coughs> right, let's go. Cape Town, it is. And I don't know how well this province is going to be because. Gain Cassie's belly upon Portugal. They're allied with America, aren't they? It's Austria and America. Uh, we'll do try not to calm things down because it'll give us a bit more jingoism and that's going to make us more war hungry, which I want actually because then we can have more war goals. Norwegian nationalists have a rose. Uh, what year is it? 1819. Okay. Let's keep going. Where are you? You're there. Taking the time. I suppose it is just a sailing button. I mean, if we had the sewers built, there would be none of this. Ah, we are actually taking attrition from that. I expected that to be the case. Right, you're going to have to make a long journey over there to Bourbon. Where that goes. Shit. And we've lost one. We've already lost a piece of artillery. What the bullshit. I knew this would fucking happen, didn't I? God damn it. But I'm not losing any more. Very annoying. Right, they should recover. Uh, we can add Medina. I think Medina is in Italy. I don't know where. There you are. Increase opinion, and we can build a thing in Wyoming. So we'll do that. There we are. Uh, the question is, do I defend this? Because at some point, America will surely want to expand into it. And I am sort of there. And they're not going to like that, are they? Oh shit, I can expand down here. Did not know that. I can take Monrovia. Well, I'm going to do that, because that's a big old piece of land, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Well, that's decent. Are these guys repairing? Replenishing? Yes, they are. Back up to 30,000. Should be up to 33,000, but... Uh, now this is going to be a massive journey. But we're going to go, we're going to go for it. We're all healed up. So... What are these islands here? Say chilies. Did not know they existed. I see, God, I did not know they even existed. Oh, a crisis! Oh, God, no, it's to do with Hungary as well. Burmese conquest of Chai Man. Oh wow. The Burmese want Chai Man, okay. Uh, what was this? About? I said the liberation of Slovakia. I'm not going to back them immediately. 
Hopefully it just won't catch anyone's eye. Ah, uh, the Ottomans are backing them. Well, I'm not going to back them. And the Austrians are backing them. Okay. I'll probably join the Hungarian Ottoman side, to be honest. Probably a wrong time to start a war, isn't it? Right. How are you doing? Are you going to replenish? Yes, you are. Uh, can we travel straight across there? I don't think we can. I've got to re-justify a war. Great. Doesn't take long, though, does it? Done. Come on. Oh, we're involved in a crisis, so we can't. Fucking hell. Our navy's right across there. Spain's back to the Ottomans. Russia will. I am supplying this side. Fuck it. Hopefully, the Ottomans will, will use this as, as a. The Prussians have, and also the Austrians should get like cut down to size, awesome. It. But oh, they accepted white peace. <sighs> God damn it, oh, the Ottomans, you shit bastards. At least we can continue with our war now. Our planned invasion of Yemen, Mani War. There we are. And we can actually invade through there. See how many men we lose on this, then. It's going to be quite a few, isn't it? Yep, look at that. 7% in... Oh, we've lost our cavalry. Ooh, I love it when we lose all our men just like this. Makes so much sense, doesn't it? Lose, like, 6,000 men in an instant. It's just fucking perfect. I love it so much. Can you tell? I'm being sarcastic. We can create a protectorate in Liberia. Oh, of course. Look at that. Well, this is going to help us now, isn't it? We can't expand any more, though. Build our naval base and our stuff. And I think that stopped us, stopped America from getting Liberia, hasn't it? Because Liberia, they usually form Liberia. I don't think we'd win this war, this battle. Go straight for the capital. <coughs> uh, create a colony. Ah, yeah. Um, right. Come on. I'm not. I. I, I shouldn't. Uh, I don't know. This. Sh I mean, I should be able to do it with one army. It's a bit annoying that I've lost three divisions. Three bits just because of attrition. The thing is, what can you really do? I'm not going to go into Taiz because. I can tell it's going to be a shit fest of mountains and stuff. Probably shouldn't have done that. 15% attrition that was, at that point then. 6.8% attrition. Right. Stop running away, let me kill you. There we go. That must have been a really shit army. I could add a war goal. Ah, I might, I might just take two bird, hit two birds with one stern, actually. Do these guys like me? Can I have military access? No. Damn. You can go and port in Bader. Uh, uh, we can also influence Tuscany, apparently. Which I will do. percent attrition. Oh, we've lost another artillery unit. That's going to make it a lot harder to actually do. Fuck, I hate this. I hate how easy it is to just lose men because of attrition. It's absolutely unsick as shit. You would never lose. I, I, I was on 33,000 men. I lost 12,000. Just because of attrition. It's bullshit. Come on, hurry. Uh, I've got a lot of a way to go as well. Right. 
you're gonna wait there. You're gonna wait in there, in fact, until you replenish. Then you're gonna go in the tiger. Another fucking crisis. Good God. I think this is to do with Austria as well. Saxe Weimar. Yeah, Czechoslovakia. Oh God. Well, I'm not gonna get involved in that if I don't have to. So I'm not what I think it'll bring me in. Salalala. Salalala. Why can I not get peace with you? Why am I so far off? Don't tell me I've got to invade Abu Dhabi as well. Oh shit, Austria accepted that. Fucking hell, Austria, you mess. You absolute mess. Oh well, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna, like. pro about that. Right, I want you to invade that. And I think this is the final thing. Otherwise, I might have to invade Abu Dhabi. And if I have to invade Abu Dhabi, then I'll probably conquer it. Uh, I think we'll leave this episode up to like 25 minutes because we're already heading that way anyway. With this bastard war. War is a nasty thing, isn't it? Ah, immediate exits. I'll accept that. And let's expand and, like, sort of make this area better. Give it some infrastructure so that I don't die whenever I fucking get into it. Right, you can cross back over there. Go back to Mokala. And will you... Yes, 3%. Going to Beda, then. We've got to somehow think about getting these these guys home. I might keep them in Yemen because at some point I'm going to actually attack again, aren't I? Attack the Omens. We'll send our navy back to Toulon and we'll begin the building of another army uh, for France. So we'll get we'll get two dragoons. We'll get a lot of engineers. These are in... No, I don't want Maghrebi. Two of them. Two of them. Two of them. And... Six of them. And that'll be okay. Sex of Weimar. I think that's you. Increase opinion. And I think I'll end it here, then. Uh, it's going pretty well... The only thing that, again, like I keep saying all the time, that's pissing me off is the whole attrition thing, but we can't really do a lot about that. Uh, this time's going to stay there. Eventually, I will send it some more troops at some point, but just not yet. Uh, I'm quite surprised about this. Bohemia Moravia. But, oh well. Austria is looking pretty goddamn wrecked. Are they even a great power anymore? Only just Hungary is a great power. So it's a good job I've got. I've got an alliance with them. Uh, yeah, so thank you. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next episode.